Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing, um, a lot of people have asked me to do this, so I kind of thought I'd try to do it. I'm going to do an eyeliner video. And I've kind of placed all of my eyeliners in front of y'all because I know a lot of people that watch my channel are probably like my mom's friends and my friends and they don't know the difference between eyeliners. So, I'm here to tell y'all. So, the first one I'm going to be trying out is, it's called the NYX Epic Ink Liner. And this is a brush tip eyeliner. And I'll kind of show y'all. Like, you can spread the bristles apart. This is a brush tip. And you can see it's really precise. It has really sharp lines. And then something like this by Aiko is, this is called a felt tip. So, it's obviously black where I did it right here but it's hard to get a more precise point with this so with all eyeliners I like using a brush tip because you can really flick it and get that perfect sharp edge all right and then this is kind of the stuff that you see your grandma using and these are the pencil eyeliners and I always joke on my mom because this is what she uses but if you can see like this is creamy has like that creamy texture and this is my Too Faced and I love this like for getting under my waterline like things like that this is great for but and this is good for just like the people that just like going all the way and stopping right here this is perfect but if you want a wing this is the way to go and then like I always like using affordable products so this is an elf one and this is a chubby one but you can tell right here like it's not that dark so I don't use it that much. It's just kind of here. And here's another elf one. And this is a felt tip. But if y'all can see. Do y'all see how that's not pointed at all? You have to buy a new one of these like every week. And like it's really dark. But it's not the best. And then. Oh, I dropped that. The last one is by Scone. And this one has a really precise tip. And it's really black too. As you can tell. So, today I'm going to be using the next one. Like, I just bought this today. Oh, wait. Pause. Rewind. There's also something called, like, um, oh, this is a gel eyeliner. Sorry. And if you can tell, I use this all the time. This is great. And I use, like, a brow pencil, like, kind of looks like this. Sorry, it's a little dirty. And you can like really get in there and wrap off the edges and watch how black this is going to be. That's the blackest one out of all of them. And that's something I like out of my eyeliners. I don't want it to be brown. I want it to be the black, black as black, as black as it can be. Okay, so now we're going to go in with the NYX, NYX, with the NYX Epic Liner. And I'm going to show y'all, sorry for my mirror. I'm probably have to look over to the side. I'm going to show you how I did my eyeliner. So, first things first, I'm going to go around my eye. So, I'm going to have to use two hands. And you'll see, like, how easily this applies. And you really shouldn't tug on your eye, but I kind of have. And like, see how I kind of got it up there by accident. You can always go back after you're done with concealer. So I went around my eye. And now I'm going to take it right here in the corner. And I'm going to go all the way up to the corner of my brow over here. And I'm going to stop about halfway. Like, so about right in here. Okay, so that's my first line that I've done. Now... What I like to do is I like to pick up my eyebrow so that way it's real straight. Well, we're not going to do that. I can do that, but y'all aren't going to be able to see it. So I kind of raise my eyebrow. And I pull it just a tad. And I flick it back in. So like when you do it, you need to, you can kind of see I have the shape of it. When you do it, you need to be real short and precise. And then I'll fill that in some. So 
and there you go and now right here kind of looks off so what I'll do is I'll close my eyes completely and there you go that's how I get my wing every day Okay, so I went around my eye, and now we're going to draw that straight line again to the eyebrow. There's my straight line. Now I'm going to kind of pull. See, there's kind of my shape for my wing. Now I'm going to fill it in some. All right, and there's wing number two. And that's how I did my wings. They're not even, and I'm sorry. I tried. It's been one of those days. But at least I've kind of got, this one's the best one. And you always, everybody has this problem. No two wings are the same. Kind of like eyebrows. They're not sisters. I mean, they're not twins. They're sisters. Some days they're cousins, and some days they're just not even related. But now I'm going to put on some mascara and I'll be right back. Okay, I'm back and I just applied the IT mascara by, no, sorry, the Superhero Mascara by IT Cosmetic. Now I'm going to show you a little trick to make your eyes look better when you do, like just a wing kind of look. So I have, it's kind of in bad condition, but I got this from the Dollar Tree in Kinston and it's just a jumbo white eyeliner. And what I like to do is I'll kind of pull this bottom thing down. And I'll put it right here. And do you see how much like this eye looks awake? Besides this one that's kind of droopy and down. So I'll apply it to this one. You can really tell, like, a big difference when you do this. All right. And then, so, like, when I'm looking at you, you see, like, right under here. Like, under my lash line, you can see that whiteness. What I like to do is I'll take this Too Faced um, eye pencil and I'll lift this up. And I'll do it right in here. I thought this is so awkward. But it makes, it just covers that little bit up. And it really makes a world of difference in my eyes. It just makes it look cleaner. Okay. So, I hope you enjoyed this super short video of all of my eyeliners. And... If you have any questions, make sure to leave them down below because this was kind of a short video and I understand a lot of people are still like getting into makeup. I mean, I'm still getting into it. There's still a lot of things that I need to learn. So make sure to like this video and comment on it if you want to see anything and subscribe to my channel. All right. Bye guys.